In this demo, you will see a digital sales order process that intelligently extracts data from incoming sales orders, processes the data directly within SAP S4 HANA, maintains a full view of all related content, and enables real-time communications with three integrated solutions. The demo shows a seamless end-to-end -end integration of SAP Digital Content Processing, SAP Document Presentment, and SAP Extended ECM by OpenText with SAP S4 HANA Sales Order Process. The process starts when Global Trade places an order for a pump with Innovate. An email attached with the PO is sent to Innovate. Kate Miller, a sales order specialist at Innovate, logs into the SAP S4 HANA Fiori Launchpad to check on the status of incoming orders and take any action if necessary. She sees some alerts in the incoming sales order tile of Launchpad. As she opens the incoming sales order tile, she sees a PO from Global Trade as well as from other companies that might also need some attention from her. As you can see, all the data related to the PO, such as price, PO number and date, material number, and item description are easy to see. All this data has already been extracted automatically by SAP Digital Content Processing using the Optical Character Recognition, or OCR, from the PO in the email. Since she received a notification, Kate wants to see the actual PO document by clicking on the Documents tab. Kate double-checks the data extracted from the PO and also clicks on the Customer tab that is part of SAP Extended ECM Workspace. In this tab, the Customer Workspace provided by SAP Extended ECM is displayed. She can see other related content such as emails and contracts with Global Trade and so on. This provides her with all the necessary business context to resolve any issues with the PO. To get to the issue, she clicks on the notification icon at the bottom of the screen where she sees a discrepancy on the item material number P100X. She can edit this order by going into the edit screen and querying the correct material number from SAP S4 HANA. Once this material number is corrected, Kate simply submits this to SAP S4 HANA for processing, which eventually creates the sales order in the SAP system. In case there is no discrepancy in the data extracted from a PO, this whole process would be touchless and Kate wouldn't have to do anything. Now that the sales order has been successfully submitted to SAP S4 HANA, Kate can start the sales order browser provided by SAP Extended ECM to check the details of the just created sales order in SAP S4 HANA. Kate can see the other details in this view and browse through the documents folders to look at the sales confirmation documentation that was generated automatically with SAP Document Presentment by OpenText once the order entry was confirmed in SAP S for HANA. Kate can also go to the sales order workspace provided by SAP Extended ECM by OpenText to view all sales order related content for global trade, including the incoming order and order confirmation and emails and other correspondence. David Curtis, who is the account manager for Global Trade, wants to review his customer sales order history. David accesses the information through the customer browser tile on the SAP S4 HANA Fiori Launchpad. David can quickly search by typing in the customer name, Global Trade, in the search box. He can now see the customer data as well as go to the workspace and filter different document types related to Global Trade. He can also drag and drop documents into the folders here as well. Additionally, under the Documents tab, he can see various types of content, correspondence, license contracts, and so on that have been declared as records for his account. David can also access other related workspaces within SAP Extended ECM by clicking on the Related tab. This gives him a full view of all information related to global trade. For instance, he can go to sales order workspace that Kate Miller was working on earlier. 
This capability is based on Fiori semantic navigation that allows you to jump between related business objects such as customer object and sales order object. David is now in the sales order browser and can see the sales order related information including the PO as well as order confirmation documents. David can also jump to the workspace related to the pump by clicking on the material number within the related tab in the sales order browser. The material browser related to the pump shows David pump description, item number, and other key data elements, as well as content in the workspace and pictures on the document tab. As before, David can now also jump to other workspaces that are related to the material or the pump in this case. In this demo, you saw an end-to-end -end digital sales order process that allows you to gain a 360-degree view of all sales order-related content, drastically reduce data entry time and effort needed to get data into your SAP S4 HANA software, help ensure data quality with high OCR accuracy and automated data verification, shorten cycle times and processing times, and streamline sales operations with automated order confirmations.